Yo, what is going on, y'all? And welcome back to a new game on the channel. I honestly was not sure if this was going to become a video or not, but I'm going to just go ahead and make it a video. Now, as you guys can see there, it says continue for me already. I kind of played quite a bit of this game before I decided to just make it a video, but yeah, I'm going to actually do the honors for just for y'all. This is how much I... This is how much I love y'all, bro. Y'all, I'm actually going back and playing this whole game again and catching up to where I am and everything so I can get content for y'all. Come on, look, come on, let's yes, yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, with all that being said, I hope y'all enjoyed this walkthrough. I've enjoyed the game that I've played so far, so I ain't even gonna spoil too much for y'all. My decisions. You know, they might be a little, you know, I might already know what's going on, but nonetheless, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and be sure to go down and hit that like button if you are new. With that being said, let's get into it. Now, guys, I haven't beat the game, so don't think this whole walkthrough is going to be just me knowing everything. But the first couple missions, I am going to know, like, the guesses I'm going to want to pick, so don't mind that. Let's begin. Why'd you kill the music? I think you know why. Um, <laughs> I don't think I do. It begins with an L? Like the L word? Lesbians. Because we don't know where the heck lost, Max. We're lost. We're just we're in geographic flux. Right. So, lost. That's debatable. Oh, heads up! Oh, oh! Nice catch there, Han. I'm not the one who hit the pothole. I forgot that was even a part. Well, maybe the pothole hit us. Ever think about that? Wow, that is like Olympic level goalpost moving. Thank you. Very impressive. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, still totally lost. Mm. Oh, yeah, definitely. You lost. know what, Max? It's okay. It doesn't make you any less of a man. You know, if Columbus hadn't gone lost and landed on these golden shores, there would be no United States of America. Goodbye, hot dogs. See you later, apple pie. Columbus never actually landed in North America. What are you talking about? Mm. Didn't even know he wasn't in Asia. Are you serious? Just another guy who didn't want to admit he was lost. Well, just another guy who's got a whole day named after him, so put that in your pipe and smoke it. Oh my god. Okay, just get us to camp already before I roll my eyes out of my head, please. <laughs> I'm working on it. I'm working on Weird it. Weird flex, but okay. What is that? You know, in the end, it is still a decision-based yeah, yeah. game, so you no know, I might not think all the decisions to the, the normal map. This is the normal map. The one on the phone. No bars. Of course not. Okay, let's see. So we are... Well, I guess they don't put summer camps on maps. Have you seen any signs for it? Hey, eyes on the road! So you know, it's usually this point in YouTubers walkthroughs where it's like, oh, what's going on? Why are they out here? But you know, I'm not even gonna force that because I already okay? know. Yeah, why, yeah. Like, you know. I mean, still in one piece. Jesus Christ, what do you think that I was? I already know the goods. A bear? What? 
No, no, Max, it wasn't a bear. What was it? I think it was a person. Lou, are you serious? Do you think we hit a person? I don't know. I mean, it was really cl close, like really close, but maybe we didn't. You know, y'all dodged that. I could have really had a, a case on your hands. <laughs> what is it? I really have this car up. Yes, you did. Well, maybe it looks worse than it is. Uh, I should check out the damage before we try to start it up again, huh? Could you grab my, uh, the, the toolbox from the trunk? Yeah, yeah, okay. He's gonna disappear, guys. I'm swallowing the whole game right now. He's he's gone. In those two seconds, it took me to hop out the car. He's already gone. It's not so bad. My mom's gonna kill me. I wouldn't do y'all like that. Come on now. now let's look around a little bit. I did miss some cars. And we are into the back. Max, why didn't you tell me? Man, the guy rejected from school and hid it from his girl. L boyfriend. Thanks, huh? Yeah. Do you need a hand? Yeah, actually, if you could just shine a light right here. Here you go. You Perfect, thank you. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Just picture yourself curling up in front of a big old fire pit singing campfire sing alongs. I don't think people curl up right in front of big old fire pits. Why not? Uh, they don't want to catch on fire. And then Picture yourself going up in front of a big old space heater. That is true. That cover would well, be anywhere is better than here. <laughs> right. <clears throat> what was that? Where are you going? Stay here. here, I'll be right back. Just stay there for a second, okay? I'm almost done. No, nah, bro, we gotta split up. God, Max, hurry up! What's going on? I'm worried that there's somebody down there. Are you serious? Yeah, that, they could be hurt, I don't know. I didn't think we actually hit anyone. Well, I don't know, I just, I heard something, okay? Like a, a woman. Do you think we hit her? I just yeah, want to check it her. out. Yeah, I'm okay. Good. All right. Just don't go too far, okay? Be careful. Yeah. yeah. <sighs> and down we go. Okay. One step at a time. Luck with the car. <coughs> there we go. Okay, so I on a humbug found this. First time through, so I'm gonna grab that. Where's that? There you go. Is there? Those help me. They like give me premonitions, so I could figure out future events. scare him poster because it's gonna scare him <laughs> all right let's move on now this should be a pretty straightforward path from whatever I wasn't really no cards up here uh 
an O. Still got that creepy atmosphere though. What the hell? Silas the Dog Boy. Bro, right now y'all gotta go down, and smash the like button, bro. I'm literally playing this guy, this this for you guys, bro. Yikes! Come on, show show your boys some move. This is too weird. Yeah, we gotta get away from this fence over here. Pretty sure that's nothing. Hello? Silence. Oh, bro, that gets me every time, bro. And I even knew it was coming. I was literally just thinking, hmm, when does that old lady pop up? She freaking got me. Hello? Yeah, let's get on up out of here, man. Say, I know she's seen that, bro. There's the paranoia kicking in. Where are you? Rightfully so, though. It's okay. It's the woods. There's a lot of stuff out there. There's a foul. No. Can we just leave? Start the yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go. My girl come back to me running out of the dark woods after we crashed. I ain't got no questions to ask, mm -hmm. bro. We gone. Yes, there we go. Burn like a kid. Max, come on. Here we go. Here we go. Nice We're getting out of here. Are you kidding me? Max! I just, okay, give me a minute. Give me a minute. We've got to go, man. Why you're not helping right now? Can you just... I am trying to get us out of here. All right, just... enough. Shit, I'm sorry. The panic is real. I'm sorry. It's okay, it's okay. We're okay. Uh-oh. We're safe in the car, really. We're gonna be okay. Jesus! Oh, ah! fuck. <laughs> oh, my God, my heart Lord, just exploded. Roll it down. <laughs> It's creepy hey, dude right here, bro. How are you doing this evening? Are either of you injured? Really, we're fine. We're just a little shaken up. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Look, see, yeah. Where did you even come from, brother? Who are you? Well, you folks want to tell me what happened here? Yeah. We, um, uh, something jumped out right in front of the car and we didn't want to hit it, so we swerved and, you know, here we are. Something jumped out? 
That's what I said. Uh, an animal. <laughs> you know, yeah. Um, it's just, it, it, don't know what kind. It was so fast and... Yeah. Well, it was most likely a deer. <clears throat> Sir? I'm sorry, officer. Why do you have blood on your neck? Keep the car running. Sir? Is this kind of like the all-time scariest cop? I don't know. This is my first cop. Uh, no. What, you're, like ever? you're correct. Uh, yeah, I'm not a criminal. Appreciate it. Much obliged. <laughs> I'm trying to get the heck out of here. Now you folks want to tell me just what in the hell you are doing all the way out here this late at night. Yo, calm down, Jamal. Don't pull out the nine. Calm down, Jamal. Don't pull out the nine. <laughs> uh, what are you saying here? Uh. We were just taken in the sights, tell. officer. Is that a crime? Ma'am, I'm going to take it by the tone of your voice that you were unaware that this is an open season hunting zone until tomorrow. Oh, nope. shit. Uh, did not know that. No, didn't know that. <laughs> We were kind of lost, actually. What is your intended destination? We're headed up to Hackett's Quarry. Hmm. Not the camp. It's a free place to stay, so, yeah. <sighs> You're not gonna make it to Hackett's Quarry. Not tonight. It's a little suspicious, officer. Harbinger Motel. It's the nearest place you can bunk up there for the night, okay? Uh, no. Nope. I think we're just gonna Not stick going to there. the plan, sir. I mean, Mr. Hackett knows we're coming and we called ahead. No, ma'am, you're gonna head to the Harbinger Motel. Do you understand? Uh, well then. Let me ask With why. all due respect, sir, why can't we go to Hackett's <clears throat> court? Because I told you to go to the motel. Okay, I just don't understand what the problem is. Ma'am, please step out of the vehicle. Whoa. What? Why? Officer, she didn't do oh, anything. No, he's driven. Ma'am, if you wouldn't mind stepping out of the vehicle, I would just like to show you a route on your map there. Okay. You know, I've seen this, but it still kind of hit the same Son? thing, Chad, you know? Remain in the vehicle. Also, I'm trying to keep the good good commentary up. It's okay. It's okay. Okay. This is my okay. way of not spoiling. Spoiling. So we. Are right about here. Are here. Harbinger Motel. Is here. Right. Okay. And where was Hackett's Quarry again? Well. I just want to know. I'm just asking. I'm sure the fine folks at the Harbinger Motel can guide you there. First thing in the morning. Harbinger Motel. Stay on the road. Watch out for potholes. Oh, you need like Have a, a statement? Have a good night. <laughs> <clears throat> well, that wasn't weird at all. This dude don't even got lights for real. Them was dim as heck. Why is this guy just sitting there?
Thanks for all your help, though, back there. What is that supposed to mean? I thought you she was going to say it to like a guy. broken washing machine. I could have used a little backup. I mean, he clearly likes you better. Well, I'm very likable. <laughs> all right, let's get back on the road. Yes. I think I've had enough woodland encounters for one night. Thank you very much. Agreed. So where's this motel? Okay, so we're here, mm -hmm. and the motel is here. Okay. But we're going here. What's there? Hackett's quarry. How'd you do that? I don't Look know. Out. I tricked him into showing you. <laughs> Very slick. Are you sure we shouldn't just get to the motel and just listen to this guy's advice? Honey, you really want to listen to the advice of some creep-ass cop who told us in the middle of the creep-ass woods to go to some creep-ass hotel? No, that sounds terrible. Yeah. Let's hit the road, shall we? That's what I thought. Ma'am? When you put it like that. Oh my god! If <clears throat> he called me ma'am one more time, I was gonna shove that badge up his dick. Hole. <laughs> Seriously, do I look like a ma'am to you? I got like 20 years before I'm a ma'am. Mm hmm. What? I, 20's debatable. Easy. I mean, I'm kinda into ma'ams. Okay, we're done here. <laughs> Ain't not wrong, you know? The quarry of Hackett's. You gotta be kidding me. There's nobody here. We drive all the way the fuck out Max, here. Max, can we just look around before we jump to conclusions? For did you no actually reason. even talk to Mr. Hackett or did you just leave a message? Well, what's the difference? This. This is the difference. <clears throat> they Hello? obviously did not prepare for this trip. I guess he doesn't check his voicemail. How was I supposed to know that? I mean, clearly there's somebody here. Yeah, or it's just an abandoned car and this is a complete waste Why of time. Why would there be an abandoned... I'll be at the car. Max, come on. Max, don't be a dick. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Well, we lost Max. Let's explore. Is anybody home? Now, if memory serves me right, there's nothing on either side, but I'm going to still check them anyway. And I was correct. Let's check the basement. Doesn't kill you will make you stronger. It is <laughs> to the basement, bro. This couldn't possibly end wrong, right? Creepy basement at a creepy camp late at night. Mr. Hackett be We're gonna get you out of there. in the basement. Hey. hey. Wait, what, what are Not these? Not be saying I anything. Say tools. Why didn't you just bring... Look, there's someone in there. Uh, I'm not seeing anyone. What? No, look. I'm looking, I am. There was definitely someone there. Okay. Okay. So... Let's take the ranch. You sure? Yeah. 
Saw it online. Damn. <laughs> nice. You need a hand? Yeah. You've seen the evil dad, right? <laughs> Hello? Sure, let's go down into the creepy basement. Are you where hurt? we saw something. Do you exist? And it didn't respond to anything. Still isn't responding. Hey, be careful. <clears throat> Is it possible? Hold on. Is it possible to just... What are you doing? I'm just... You know, I'm scoping it out. Okay. Nope. Can't just leave. Coming back to me. Something did that to that dog, though, for sure. Hun, maybe it was a possum or something. No, there was there was someone here. I swear. Hey, it's been kind of a night, you know. Let's just get to the motel. We can come back here first thing in the morning. We can check everything out, but... I mean, you must be exhausted. I know I am. I think our imagination... Max? Max? It's looking bad for Max. Max. Max, no! I think I'm bleeding a lot. So there's like no way to prevent that from happening, bro. Not gonna lie to you, I tried to prevent it from happening. I mean, there's always this. <laughs> Max, you can do it, bro. Almost there. So I'm confused though, did he shoot her? I don't know. To be continued.
I need answers. I was so close to finding answers. friend welcome to the show we are friends Hello. aren't we i've waited for you i've waited yes so i do hope our time together proves enlightening oh, every there's time no need to here. worry i'm she here to help you. Oh, you know think of me as out. your guide into the unknown it's exciting yes and terrifying. But if you're brave enough, if you let me help you, I can help you. We can help each other. That's what I'm here for. For your help. This is the card you found. The fool. I wonder who this is. We all know a fool when we see one, don't we? Innocence and freedom. Yep. All recklessness and risk-taking. Spontaneity. Actions without thought, but the consequences to match. Think. Think, and don't get burnt. I can show you more if you'd like me to. Yes, show this me This is what might come to pass. A possible future. A path yet unchosen. Look here, look here. There are secrets out there, you know. Secrets and lies. Paths to uncover on which I can shed light if you let me. Help okay. me help you. And remember, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ladies. Peace and love. See you later, kids. Yeah, Hackett's quarry forever. <laughs> yes, sir. And the story begins. You know how many hearts are broken on the last day of summer camp? It's like a romance apocalypse. <clears throat> you never know. I mean, you never know. The universe has a kind of way of uh, working these things out. The universe? Yeah, like the uh, the cosmic space gods. Space gods. You heard me. Okay, spell it. Nothing to spell. You know, we're cool. Oh, so cool. We are super cool. <gasps> so she dumped her ass, huh? <laughs> <laughs> There's no dodge in there, bro. She's going to burn them either way. Hi, Emma. Hey. Okay, this is, um, you've heard of spatial awareness before, yeah. right? Spatial awareness is for nerds. Uh, be a lamb and grab the last couple of bags, will ya? Yes, boss. Say hi to Emma for me. You're a bad person. Yes, I am.
Oh no, can I go back here? I actually never looked back here the first time through. I wasn't trying to go near that door. What you doing, Ryan? Hey, what are you uh what are you listening to? Before they knew it, the whole place was up in smoke. Good to know. Boy just put his thumbs up, what the heck? I know it's something down there. I'm coming for you. Jesus Christ. They locked the door? Hey. Hey, are you guys gonna help with the bags or what? Oh, um, you know, I was actually just working on fixing uh the door. It's Dylan, come it's on, broken. Right. Dylan, please. I can't it's, it's I gotta get the last bags what's in there. Come wrong on with this thing, it's just Dylan, it's please. Sorry, bro. <sighs> cool, thanks guys. Hey, ill man. <sighs> Dipshit's bolted it? Really? All right. Got to go in the hard way. After a word from our sponsors. All right, <laughs> let's go. And we are in. <laughs> Skill. <sighs> Dude did not just. He jumped in the room and said Ugh. skill. Horror. I hate horror. How convenient. I did not find this one last time. Nice. Had to take my time to explore a little bit, I see. Man, that's a bad place to get stuck. bags great all by yourself huh yep guess you're gonna have to get used to that oh my god you are so mean <laughs> at least i'm honest oh okay here we go okay you're not telling me the whole truth about you and emma are you son oh okay so now who's oh the bait i just gotta take jake Ooh, bars. Oh, I'm sorry. I just got so distracted about that rhyme. I forgot what we oh, were. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, you, you were telling me how you totally yeah, have a thing for Ryan. It, Wait, are we talking about Ryan, the sailing instructor with the sexy brooding loner thing that totally doesn't do anything for me at all? Hmm. <laughs> Knew it. <laughs> Who said I was hiding that? I'm not. I'm just, you know, I feel like if you really did like the guy, you would have made a move by now. Really just dumped her ass, huh? I don't know. Her whole thing is yeah. like, I'm gonna make blah. My whole thing is like, you know, maybe long distance, blah, 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 blah. And she was just like, Jacob. She gave you the look, huh? Yeah, do not pass go. Man, she just got <clears> you wrapped <throat> all the way around that dainty little finger of hers. How does she do it? Okay, okay, you know what? Maybe you're <clears> right. <throat> he does have like this superpower. Oh, but you know what? Maybe I like it. I beg your pardon? 
Okay, so are we sure that this old rust yeah, bucket's roadworthy? <laughs> we'll take I'm a look. Jacob. It better be. One more night in the great outdoors might actually kill me. Hey, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Well, I haven't killed you yet. Yes, sir. And you're still pretty pathetic. Hey. Uh, okay, so, um, total hypothetical, but if I was, like, a huge asshole and I wanted to break down the van so we'd have to spend another night here, uh, what exactly would I need to do? Well, you'd probably break the fuel line or, I don't know, rip out the rotor arm. And yes, that would make you a total asshole. Okay, and what does a rotor arm look like again? It's like an arm that's all rotary. You know, it's under the little black dome with the leads poking out. Jake, you do realize that even if we somehow did get stuck out here, one more night with Emma wouldn't make a difference. Trust me, Chick's made up her mind. Yeah. Sure. Jacob, I guess get everybody fun. messed up, man. I'm gonna at least help him make a good decision for now. We ain't breaking oh, nothing. Buddy. I'll put you right back tomorrow. You gotta eventually leave. No harm, no foul. Up here, my dudes. Why do they look like they're up to something? Hey, Jacob. What? No, dude, please. D d d Go long. Oh, dick. QT. Boom. Oh. oh, there it is. Big cage, Ooh. man. Good sign. Freak. Oh. Oh. Ooh, I wish I had some singles. Oh. Freaks. <clears throat> I'm surrounded by freaks. <clears throat> oh, thank God. I'm gonna get the whole no technology thing, but take me back, world. You would have thought Mr. H could have, like, charged up our phones, like, a little bit. Nothing's ever your fault, is it? <laughs> you know, you should really just save it for emergencies only. <laughs> Unless, of course, is being dumped <laughs> an emergency? Ha <laughs> oh, Ben. Dang, bro. Jacob can't get direct from nobody. <laughs> Wouldn't let that shit happen to me, though. Back off, dipshit. I'm sorry. I... Peace and love, <laughs> man. I, I didn't mean to hurt the fans. <laughs> Don't be mad at me, chat, bro. At the full send. Where is everybody else? Why Why would I know that? Mm -hmm. Sometimes you know stuff I don't. Look, I don't... I don't even know how to respond to that. You say Nick. You're way smarter than me, and you're a super hot stud who gets any cheeky ones. Okay, yeah. Keep German Jr. You're not Damn. that guy, pal. Trust me. You're not that guy. Introducing... Abigail. Artist extraordinaire. I was trying to think of some... Quips to give her, I couldn't think of nothing. Hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. Ooh. Oh boy. You're about to get your phone back, Easy. aren't you? Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito-infested backwoods dump. Doors locked, bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. Well, it's obvious what we have to do here. Find someone with a key? Shape our destiny. And by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Okay. Let's do it. We better not get into trouble. I won't tell if you won't tell. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. So what? I'll just think it was a bear or something. Have you ever seen a bear you in the woods? Gotta get the bags. No, but that doesn't mean they're not out there. Fair point. All right, let's do this. On three. One. Two. Who? Three. Yeah. Ugh. All about the power have chosen. of positive thinking. Why do I ever listen to you? Because I'm always right. 
Are you sure they're gonna think it was a bear? Oh, my God, relax. It's not like we killed someone. All right, well, I'm just gonna take another look around, make sure we didn't miss anything. Go nuts. Bro, there's gotta be at least 20 endings to this game. At least. Nothing in here, right? Can't believe I'm actually gonna miss all those lumpy loose springs. Aw. This is <clears> little <throat> Izzy's. You can probably just stay here, you creepy little thing. All right, and we're out of here. Gonna be weird not waking up to Dylan's morning announcement. Yeah. Huh. Camp's over though. So. Leave. It's like no. <laughs> okay, that was wasn't creepy at all. Hope Jacob hasn't seen this. <sighs> Ugh. Ugh. What is that? Is it Dylan's? Ugh. Ready to roll? Time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. How are you so... Dramatic. Annoying. Confident. It's just acting. It's what the people want. So you're faking it? I mean, in a way, faking it is... Red flags. Just being yourself. But louder. You should try it sometime. You never know who you might impress. No. <laughs> it's too late now anyway. For what? You and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. <gasps> oh, oh, wow! Oh. <gasps> nice steering <laughs> tech. Jinkies. Okay, so hypothetically, if I were to put myself out there, what if he ends up being a dud? Kind of like you and Jacob. It's actually really sweet. Then why'd you quit it? Summer fling. We're going to school like four states away. I, he gets it. Yeah, sure. Hmm. But that's us. You and Nick could be different. Why don't you get his handle? Hit him up. Oh, I already have his email. It was in the packet they gave to us on the first day. Email? Are you not Not his email. What's wrong with email? I'm really gonna miss you, Abby. Oh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. Why? Come on, scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp? Man, we're going to the camp. We should really get back. Boo, thumbs down. I've, everyone's waiting for us. Nick isn't gonna leave without saying goodbye. Shit, Abby! Too close. Sorry, squirrel dude. My girl here is on her way to ask a guy out for the first time, like, ever. Emma! <laughs> Couldn't let okay. her squirrel out of it. 
I am going to throw you out of the cart. I deserve that. Guys, it's not my fault, bro. We just really had to get back to the camp. Don't worry, Jacob. I got you. I got a full tank of gas, so... Oh, fuck me. <laughs> oh, idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? It, there's no signal out here anyways, dude, okay? This place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy? What? No. <laughs> Hey, it's okay, yo. I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. And... Uh, you. <sighs> and they have arrived. Hey, Nick. Hey, where were you guys? <gasps> Wouldn't you like to know? Ignore her, please. Let's go. Just gotta get these bags up on to the... Oh, hey, hey, here, let me, um... Let me get it for you. I can take care of my own bag, thank you. What? Are you sure? Because, I mean, it's really not that big she of a deal. She can take care of her off. own bag, thank you. We can both take Ew. care of our own bag. Thank you. Ale. Jacob just catching hella ales cool. out here, bro. Ugh. <sighs> eh? Eh? Uh, Abby, do you need... Yeah. Can I... Thank you. Smooth, Nick. <laughs> we can both take Ew. care of our own bag. Ironic after old girl just hey, has anyone seen Ryan? Bags, though, but, you know. Oh yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious and alluring somewhere. <laughs> I'm here. What were you doing under there? Having a little me party? Uh, I was listening to a podcast, actually. Oh, podcast, nice. That's cool. For your information. What's it about? I think it's called How to Mind Your Own Business. You should listen to it. Ghosts. Ghosts? <laughs> yeah, well, all sorts of cryptozoology, really. The, the episode I was listening to was actually about this place. Oh, yeah, yeah, the one that you were talking about to the uh, kids at the campfire. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Yes. What's the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? You don't know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, if I did, would I be asking them ass? Tell her about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. It's all uh, coming together, though. That's crazy. I think she know about the Hag of Hackett's uh, Quarry. Can we just please stop saying the Hag of Hackett's That's Quarry? That's some spoiler stuff right there. It's just this campfire story for the kids. It's, um, there's supposedly an old woman who died in a fire a few years back. She haunts the woods looking for her lost baby boy. There are, like, reports of whispers or whatever, and then this figure that floats around, you know, textbook ghost stuff. Some people say that if she catches you alone, she'll try to turn you into her son or kill you or something. I don't know. It's never really been clear. Anyways, Haga Haggett's Corey. You made that up. Well. It's right here in the podcast, man. Cool story, bro. Seriously, though, you should have seen the first time you told the story to the kids at the campfire. They were scarred for life. I mean, not for life. <laughs> you got to be careful with this stuff, man. This shit's true. Dude, I'm sorry, y'all. If the comms is, the hold up, is low right now, I'm just trying to pay attention. Yeah, yeah, nearly game. done, Mr. Oh, H. No, up to it. This is one of those games. Get those butts in gear. Sorry, Mr. I H. I want to just talk to all the dialogue. Yeah, deliberate some luggage. Shut up. Maybe if somebody didn't spend so much time trying to press the ladies' ball as ghost stories. You asked. Ghost stories? The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Oh! <sighs> hey, you still have the van key, Mr. You heard H? It? Well, yes, I do. You know, I'd lose my head if it wasn't stuck on. 
Back to the office I go. Give me a hand, would you, Ryan? Oh, okay. Yo, Mr. H. Can you help the find What's up, keys? DJ Dylan? Any chance I could get a little charge? I want to have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. Cool, cool, yeah. No worries. Good man. Uh, no big deal. You can share my earbuds. Chris, I, I'm, well, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. Y'all know when it comes uh, down to it, uh -oh. I'm gonna end up having I'm to pick fired, Brenda, y'all. <laughs> no, I no, can't, that's, I can't, um, hey. it's just, you know, about the whole thing w with the... Hold that thought, partner. I'm gonna have to take this. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, sorry. Hello. Brenda like Ryan, and it look like Dylan like Ryan, but you know, what? Ryan might like like Brenda, you know, you know. <laughs> They're almost out of here, all right. You're cutting it pretty close. We don't want to have. Just hold your damn horses, all right. Everything's a okay on this end. Bobby and I are geared up. If he's in the area, we'll get him. This is a waste of time. You know what? I know it. No, should I have? He's gone quiet. Probably staying out of the way. Speaking of which, the longer you keep me on this damn phone, the longer it's gonna take me to get rid of these damn kids. Yeah, of course. Adios. And he's gonna get caught. Sorry, I, I wasn't. I wasn't listening. I didn't even. I, I was move. just like waiting. Like I mean, I heard. I, I mean, I was—I didn't hear what you were. You we're cool, champ. Day. Just come on in. Sorry, I pushed you out like that. You, uh, you need a hand looking for the keys? Uh, no, end of summer, busy, busy. You know. Anyway, you were asking me. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. It was just the whole animation school thing. What you thought I should do? Right. Y you know. Whether or not I should like leave my sister with my grandparents since I'd have to live on campus, you know, and my mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to leave Sarah on her own. You know, fam our family's small enough as it is. Well, family is important, Ryan. Dang it. What's going on with you, man? Is everything okay? You got a hot day tonight? Oh boy. If you only knew. <laughs> so, uh, what, what did you need me for? You're one of my favorite counselors, Ryan. You know that. One of the good <clears> ones. <throat> but, do you know how many calls I get from parents? Letter after letter of these terrified kids that they send home. Huh. I, I didn't realize that. Believe it or not, scaring kids away from sleepaway camp is kind of bad for business. So maybe just ease up on the ghost stories. Why the fuck you lying? Man, man, ain't nobody worried about no ghost story, stories, bro. <laughs> it was just a fun story that weirdo kid told me last month. Hey, there's no weirdo here. At Hackett's Quarry, say, everyone's well, gotta be a weirdo, their own bro. brand of cool. You cancelers gotta be the responsible ones. Keep the kids happy. Keep the kids safe. So knock it off. That is yeah. not what that has just said, bro. I mean, we are. Seriously, Chris, what's going on? I just want to get you guys safely out of Dodge before the sun goes down. Stop fucking lying. Why? It's getting dark, Ryan, and it's not safe to drive in the dark. And safety is the first step towards fun.
Just give me a minute. Mm. Where in the You're good not being goddamn honest. are they? Will you say goodbye to Caleb and Kaylee for me? They sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see him again next year. Caleb works at the scrapyard during the off season, and Kaylee, well, she's still figuring out what she wants to do. She's got her whole life ahead of her. They both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? I actually could have used the help packing up since we were short-staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. But I'll tell them both you were sad you missed them. Unlocked the van, put the keys in my pocket, came in the office. Right where I left. Eureka. Uh, there you go. Let's skedaddle. This dude brought Ryan in to try to help him find some keys, bro. Like, Ryan ain't see the keys. Make sure they're all ready to go. For real this time. Wait, how did you get your phone back before the rest of us? I never turned it in. You sure did turn it off before you handed it in, Dylan. Them's the rules, you noob. I try not to dwell on the past, man. Good. Because it's time to dwell in the minivan. Get on with our respective lives. Move it. Let's go. What's the problem? Ugh. Oh, dude, I don't know. I, I think I'm wrong. Oh, Jacob messed straight. up the car. Yeah, what happened? Yeah, dude, it's just like kaput. All right, let me try. Wonder why. What, dude, I'm telling you, all right? It's busted. Well, maybe you're doing well, it wrong. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. What the fuck, dude? Enough. Enough, both of you. Shit. Come on. All right, Come dude, on. Chill. Chill, dude. I'm oh, down there about to punish Jacob. Damn it. I thought I told you kids to check everything. We did. It, it should be working. Yeah, well, coulda and shoulda doesn't mean it is. Does it? Yeah, life is like life is what it is, but life is not what's made made of what's life was. Damn it! Okay, well, uh, look, it's not that big of a deal. Okay, we'll just spend one more night here. No, no, just stop. Say Let goodbye. me think. Okay. It's not a lot of Damn thinking, it. bro. You're right. You're right. Yeah. What? Yeah, you're right. <clears throat> hey, Brian. Come here for a sec. Make sure that everybody is inside the lodge for tonight. Lock the doors. No one in, no one out. No one. Got it? What's going okay. on? Tell me. I'll be back first thing See, in the all morning. these secrets just in the end we'll begin people messed road. up, bro. You just have to keep everyone inside. Can you promise me you'll do that? Wait, For you need to stay right? inside until tomorrow? Why? Where are you going? Ryan, I need you to trust me. Like I'm trusting you. I need you, you to that? explain why I should trust you. Lock the doors. And for God's sake, keep the noise down! He just left us for dead, bro. So, what was that about? He, uh, said to stay inside, that we're not leaving until the morning. Are you kidding me? Um. Are you kidding me? 
What are we supposed to do? Well, we should go inside, like he said. We could go inside until morning. Yeah. Or... Or... Or we could do something else. No, 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 no. You seem pretty concerned. really listen to what Chris told us to do. Of course. Uh, who cares what Chris told us to do? He's not our boss anymore. P-A-R-T. Why the fuck not? All right, it seems like the stars have aligned for us, no? Okay, okay, okay. One last epic bonfire blowout for all time. Oh, dude. Fuck yes, I'm in, Nick. You're in. Yeah, I'm in. Dylan's in, obviously. My man, Caitlin. I go where my people need me. Yeah, okay. M. Majority rules, say? bro. Mm -hmm. Ain't nothing Ryan can say about <laughs> yeah, that. Yeah, I'm in. Mr. Hackett seemed pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. He, he was just trying to freak us out, you know? Like, um... Like one of Ryan's stupid ghost stories. Why would he want to scare us? <laughs> Great point. I don't think he was trying to freak us out, Jacob. I think he was really freaked out by something. Jesus Christ. Chris seemed real serious about this, guys. Just say you're in, man. Come on, one last night. Yeah, Dude, he won't even know. I, I promised. I no, 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 D dude, dude. It's all good. All right, we get it. You know, you uh, you don't want to disappoint Daddy. Yeah, well, someone's got to give a shit. Oh. You know what? <gasps> I don't even care what you guys do. Oh. I'm doing what Chris told Boo! me. Oh. Ryan, come on, man. Wait. All right, all right, all right, Hacketeers. Party planning committee, let's do this. Um, okay, first things first. Nick and Abby, you will get some firewood. Uh, M and I will go to the stores for some supplies. Hey, now they not out the head of help uh, Ryan, Dylan, though. Just, oh, I'll I don't probably know, figure out how to that chat. charge the phones for something. I'm sure All right, let's do this. Not finna party with him. Open season, boys. Got some hunting to do. I got serious, man. Yeah. I was hoping you'd come back to me. I have returned. Let's see what Madam. you found. Temperance. <laughs> to be balanced. To consume in moderation. Or to indulge in excess. Temperance. Take it or leave it. But remember, sometimes, with temperance comes deferred gratification. What do you mean? There's more I can show you, if you like. Yes, show me. I was hoping you'd say that.
you'd better be going. Mm. It's still early and the moon is bright, but time won't wait. Mm, that's good Not to for know. those with a story to tell. Be careful. Look out for yourselves. And look out for my cards. <laughs>